Alright guys, this video is probably going to be the last rant about Black Ops 4 uh, because I've done, I don't, actually have I done a lot? I'm not too sure, anyway look, it doesn't matter, either way, this is going to be one of the last rants about Black Ops 4, I don't want to put out too much of these types of videos, but it just like, as me, as a person, who has been playing Call of Duty since Black Ops 1. I, I'm so frustrated actually, every single day I'm frustrated. You wanna know why I'm frustrated every single day? Because I am a person who absolutely loves, is passionate about putting 8 to 10 hours a day into a game, okay? Black Ops 4 for example, right? As much as I hated that game, I love Call of Duty as a franchise and as the game itself, that's why all I play is TDM because I love to jump into a simple TDM game, there's no relying on teammates for capping a flag or any of this sort of stuff. Stuff. it's just a basic flat out game mode you just go in it's based off of kills so you know it's not flags and points it's just kills and it's a very basic game mode it, you know i love putting in hours and hours of playing a game every single day but when black ops 4 is the game it is one that has no rewards one that has no longevity like if you get dark matter and you get level a thousand and you don't want to play zombies or blackout and you just love multiplayer like me you're fucked like you're actually fucked if you don't want to play the game every single day just to play it which i don't think a lot of people do then there's no point in jumping on the game like that seriously is for me like i was on a grind since the game came out every single day even when i was at school there's nothing left for me like there genuinely isn't i'm gonna play a little bit of blackout i'm not gonna play zombies and i'm not gonna go for dark matter and you may be wondering why would you not go for dark matter well because it, for one it looks really ugly and i don't even want to have the camo and two it's just a challenge that i don't want to do it, it really isn't it would you know be something i could work on but i don't want to and blackout well i'll play that a bit soon as well but we're specific specifically talking about multiplayer all right so this is why i hate black ops 4 for one there is no prestige rewards through the 100 levels like 100 200 300 i've already talked about this i did a whole video on the reward system uh, they're needing to be one and you know that there isn't one and it lacks rewards and lacks longevity and consistently playing because the only reason I was playing Black Ops 4 as much as I was because I wanted to get level 1000 that was the only reason that was the only grind and milestone I had to work towards through the hundreds of levels there is no rewards and level 1000 gives you no rewards either you know I already talked about having a, a mark 2 weapon every 200 levels and then you know a special something or other at level 1000 to say this is what you did good shit you know but there is absolutely nothing i talked about advanced warfare giving you uh elite weapons every two prestiges after max prestige because it went up to prestige 30 master prestige 30 is like the equivalent of level 1000 okay and there's just nothing no reason for me to come back on black ops 4 i'm level 1000 now i've got diamond on all the guns i want diamond and then the game itself is very annoying you've got the specialists you've got talk people camping behind assault shields um, is that assault shields? The, the microwave shield with torques, razor wire, and then you've got fucking zeros hacking. You've got um, Ajax's, you know, nine bang and all that sort of stuff. The game is just annoying. So annoying to the point where I don't want to play it each day just to play it. That's where Call of Duty was at me. It was for me at some point. You know, I even loved Black Ops 4, or Black Ops 2 so much that I reset my stats at Prestige Master and played it all the way back to Master again. I, and, and did that, you know, because I just wanted to play the game to play the game. And even at Master, when I did it for the second time, um, I just jumped on to play because it was a fun, it was a genuinely a fun game. But see, my problem with Black Ops 4 is that there's no reason for me to want to come back and play it. If the specialists were a little bit less annoying, you know, Zero didn't exist and the, the specialists were dumbed down and there had been rewards throughout these 100 levels up to level 1000, then I'd probably come back to play the game because I'd actually have these rewards, I'd have these special Mark II weapons to use in-game and be like, hey, I'm level 1000, this is the gun I have, look at me. You know, even for level 1000, if there was a special calling card like you do with the 100 percenter or each 100 levels, you got that calling card from each individual game. So you get four custom emblems to choose from, you get four calling cards, that represented those prestiges from those games and then at level 1000 you got those calling cards as well but some you know specific awesome camo and calling card to show that you've reached level 1000 like the royalty camo on advanced warfare um and if you got something like that as well and special gear for your specialist but yeah that's just my main issue with black ops 4 guys uh if you've watched to this point of the video i really do appreciate you i'm very frustrated right now i've been frustrated for the past week and a half maybe even couple months honestly 
Um, just because Black Ops 4 is such a letdown, you know, Treyarch is the biggest letdown developer that I have ever seen in a Call of Duty. I would rather play Ghosts than Black Ops 4. I'm just so frustrated with this game. There was so much potential in it, and don't get me wrong, I love a lot of the core values of the game. I love the weapons in this game. I love crash as a specialist i love recon i used him quite a lot when i first started playing i love the gunfights i love the manual healing the 50 extra health is a little bit uh, i'm on the fence with that one but i love the manual healing it gives you a lot more control of your gunfights it's just a, a, a mechanic that i think is really good for call of duty i just love a lot of things about the game but then there's more that overshadow that and just make it so damn annoying and and that's what i wanted to say i just needed to say this you know there's so much that they could do with this game even daily rewards like Black Ops 3, hey, you got crypto keys and there were the weekly rewards, the daily rewards, the triple play, what about, what happened to that? What about when you start a new account on Black Ops 3, you, you use the total victory and you get a guaranteed bribe drop at the end of 75 wins or the triple plays, 100 wins and you get 10 supply drops, a guaranteed ranged weapon and a melee weapon, like, just, dude, they had it all. They had Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3, all of this. You know, Treyarch was sitting at the highest list of the devs for Call of Duty because of what they'd done, the games they'd made, and now we have Black Ops 4, the most disappointing Call of Duty I've ever played. I don't know what's going on. I would rather play World War 2 because there was so much in that game, so much replay value to it. You know, you could go to the hub, the player hub, where you'd be in third person, you could do all the emotes, and you could throw down supply drops, and people could watch you open them. You could go do rewards. You could, uh, you know, just buy contracts. That would give you more points back and stuff like that there was a mailbox where you'd receive free rewards for this that and the other and just like black ops 4 is so dumbed down it's like a fucking peeled carrot okay you got a chunky big carrot that just gets peeled down to a thin pencil you know I don't know if that's a good analogy, but that's what it feels like to me. But with Infinite Warfare, a game that got hated so much, it has a lot of rewards, it has so much replay value to it, you know? These are the classic weapons that you use a token on, every two prestiges you can get a, an old school weapon, there is daily login bonuses, there's challenges, there's all of this great stuff, not to mention that the DLC weapons have the ability to be unlocked within like an hour, hour long max challenge that will give you the DLC weapon, you know, you can craft variants and just all of that sort of stuff and not to mention the deatomizer, the callable nuke streak and that's all I wanted to say here in this video man, I'm just so frustrated with Call of Duty right now and I genuinely, genuinely think that if Modern Warfare 4 does not succeed this year the way the community wants um, and it flops just as badly as Black Ops 4 or worse, Call of Duty is done for, man. I'll definitely move on to a, a different game if, if Modern Warfare 4 is actually just a shithole. Like, I won't even give it a go throughout the months if it's a shithole. And you know what, I probably will because I love Call of Duty so much. You know, scrap all, everything I just said, actually. I probably will play it because I fucking love this franchise. I've been playing this game since Black Ops 1, like I've mentioned. I haven't played any other game since then because I don't get any other satisfaction from a game besides Call of Duty, you know? It's like, I just don't, I just don't get it. I don't know what they're doing and I hope that they can prevail with Modern Warfare 4 or whatever this year's COD is actually because I'm just going to give that little ray of, you know, ray of thought that uh, it might not be m 4 and I think you guys should too because there is a small, slight chance that it may not be. So thank you all so much for listening and tuning into my rant because I know a lot of people feel the same as me. It's just that I'm a content creator. I want to do this full time and um, and it's very hard to, you know, make content sometimes with COD in such a shit position. I'm doing pretty well with my videos at the moment, which I'm quite proud of. Doing different things here and there, commentaries like this, um, you know, what I can work with and everything like that. But I've got a Blackout video coming soon. I've got Infected. I'm going to play some Prop Hunt as well. That'll be really, really awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you all next one. If you watched this point in the video, let me know your feedback and your thoughts about what I said down in the comment section below. I'd like to see what you guys thought. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great day, everybody, and I'm out.